bring your hands in Namaste Mudra. Closing the eyes. Exhale. Fully inhale. Taking a moment to set an intention for your practice. And then release the hands, staying for an extra moment here with the eyes closed. Bringing the awareness into the body. Deepening the breath, softening the face, the eyebrows, the cheeks, the shoulders, spine nice and straight, relaxing the belly. Start off with a mini round of pranayama, taking five stronger inhales and exhales. We use three parts. We use the belly, the diaphragm and the lungs, inhaling in the entire upper body. Starting off with an exhale. Inhaling, filling the upper body up. Mini pause, completely exhale. Mini pause, completely inhale. Mini pause, completely exhale, releasing the old. Mini pause, inhaling fresh energy. Holding, exhaling, tension. Holding, inhaling, holding, exhaling, holding, one final inhale, holding for a few seconds, again close the eyes, relax the body completely and then completely exhale, holding the breath for about 10 seconds. Trust your body. Gaze into the distance of your eyelid for another three, two, becoming empty, one, completely inhale. About 90% full, holding the breath again, relaxing the shoulders, Five more seconds. And release. Sighing it out. And Let's find our way into a tabletop position, slowly blinking the eyes open, keeping the meditative focus while you move, coming onto all fours. Hands directly underneath the shoulders, knees directly underneath the hips, pressing all 10 fingers down, space between each fingertip, index and middle fingers more or less parallel to each other and the insides of your elbows move forward and then begin to inhale arch the spine gazing up exhale rounding the spine 
in your arching. Exhale, rounding. In. Exhale, initiating the movement from the base of your spine. Neck comes last. In. Exhale. Last one. Inhale. Exhale round. And this time let's stay rounded. Keep breathing. Tuck the toes. And we will lift up the knees a centimeter. Rounding the spine. Pulling in the navel. Two more breaths. About 10 seconds. Chin close to your chest. Final breath. Exhale, walk your feet a little bit to the back and moving back into a down dog. Spreading your fingers. Bring your heels a little bit out, your toes a little bit in, bending your knees enough so you can pull your tailbone back to the back side. Just staying here for one more inhale before slowly walking forward one by one on the length of one complete exhale then inhaling halfway once you've reached the front of the mat exhaling folding forward crown becomes heavy inhaling rolling up to, sp to stand circling the arms up Reaching long to the sky. Exhale, circling down. Getting ready for Sun Salutation A. Beginning to engage Ujjayi breath. Gentle squeezing of the back of the throat. Same thing as when you fog a mirror. Establishing a rhythmic breath. Grounded into your feet, toes together, heels slightly apart, and then begin to inhale, raise and circle the arms up, touching the fingertips above your head, reaching long, circling the arms down with an exhale, gazing down, inhale, circling up, exhale, circling down. Three more like that. Inhaling. Exhaling. Two more. Reaching long. Exhale. One more. Surya Namaskar A. Inhale. Reach. Exhale, begin to dive forward. Fingers to the front, hips to the back, and then coming down on the same exhale. Inhaling halfway. Exhaling, stepping back, high plank. Lowering down your knees, straightening the arms, bringing the hips all the way to the back. Forehead lowers down briefly. Now keep the arms straight. Begin to roll forward. Nice rounding in your spine. Body very loose. Only the arms straight. And naturally allowing the hips to lower down. Raising the chest up. Chin slightly up. Staying here for an extra breath. Pulling the shoulders to the back before you tuck the toes again and exhale into a down dog. Just two more breaths. One more. Bending the knees, exhaling, gazing forward. And walk or jump. Bringing your toes together, your heels apart, inhaling halfway. Either with your fingertips down or with your hands on the shins to find more length. 
chin comes forward. Exhaling, falling forward deeply. Inhaling, bring your arms to the back. Try to straighten your spine as much as you can before you ascend. Raising the arms up on the same inhale, long to the sky. Fingertips touch. Exhale, circling down. Another round of Surya Namaskar A. Inhaling. Exhaling, becoming long, diving forward. And coming all the way down. Inhale, halfway, gazing. Belly hollow. Exhale, stepping back. And on the same exhale, Chaturanga. With the elbows close against the ribcage. Now inhale, either with the knees down or slightly lifted into cobra or up dog. And exhaling, down dog. Again, three breaths. Inhaling, reaching the tailbone back. Exhaling, very slightly move the spine, keeping the pose loose, not too static. Two more breaths. Ujjayi breath. One more inhale. Exhale, bend the knees, gaze forward. And walk or jump. Toes together, heels apart, inhaling halfway and gazing forward. Exhaling, folding forward deeply. Crown becomes heavy, forehead close to the knees. Inhale with the arms to the back, straight spine raising up. Arms reach along. And exhale all the way down. Again, Surya Namaskar A. Inhale, reach. Keeping the breath soft, the body soft. When you exhale and descend forward and down. Inhaling halfway, keeping the belly loose. Exhale, stepping back. Chaturanga. Inhale. Cobra or up dog. Feeling the spine arch. Very gentle engagement of the glutes. Exhale, down dog. Again, just three breaths. Inhale, reach your hips to the back. Exhale, release any staticness in this pose. Inhale, feel the entire upper body fill up with air all the way down into the pelvis. Exhale, roll it back along the spine, out through the crown and the hands. One more like that. Before you bend the knees, gaze forward and walk or jump. Toes together, heels apart, inhaling halfway. Exhaling, folding. Inhaling to standing. Exhaling, circling down. Just one more like that. Inhale, reaching long. Exhale, diving forward. And down. Inhaling halfway. Exhale, stepping back. Chaturanga. Cobra or up dog. Exhale, down dog. Only for one breath. Inhale. Becoming long. Exhale, gazing forward and walking or jumping. Halfway. Folding. Inhaling to standing. Circling the arms down. Finding an extra breath here. Spreading all your ten fingers. Getting ready for a Surya Namaskar B. Squatting down. We'll do a variation of Surya Namaskar B. Inhale, chair pose. Reaching. Exhale, folding forward. 
Inhale halfway. Exhale, stepping back. Now you can do optional vinyasas or you can move straight back into down dog. Inhaling up dog. Exhaling down dog. If you don't know what a vinyasa is, it's sometimes the name of the movement from Chaturanga to up dog to down dog. Taking an extra inhale here. Stepping your right foot forward. If you don't reach all the way forward, you can heel toe further forward. Keep the left heel lifted. Make sure that the right knee is right above the right heel. And then inhale into crescent lunge, reaching your fingertips high, sinking forward into that right knee, straightening that left leg, hips squared forward, long in the waist. Make sure your knee is not collapsing inward, but keep bringing it a little bit outward. One more inhale. Exhaling all the way down. Stepping back. High plank and Chaturanga on the same exhale. Inhale, Cobra or Up Dog. Exhaling, Down Dog. Taking one extra breath here. Exhaling, stepping forward your left foot. And again, same thing if you need more space. Heel towing the left foot forward. And then inhale, raising up. Crescent lunge. Sinking more forward into that left knee so that the left knee is right above the left heel. Inhale, reach your fingertips to the sky. Coming back to your Ujjayi breath, if you've lost it, feeling the heat in your body. One final inhale. Exhale, lowering down. Stepping back. Optional vinyasa, or go straight back into down dog. Staying here for a bit longer this time, about five breaths. If you feel you need a break, you can come into child's pose, simply lowering down the knees and resting there. Taking one final breath. Bending the knees, gazing forward and walking or jumping. Inhaling halfway. Exhaling, folding. Inhaling all the way to chair pose. Standing up and circling the arms down. Taking an extra breath. We will do one final round for modified Sun Salutation B. Inhale for your chest raise, your crown reach long to the sky, steadying your gaze. Exhale, spreading all your 10 fingers, squatting down, touching all 10 fingers tips to the ground. Inhaling chair pose. Exhaling, folding forward. Inhaling halfway. Now, different than last time, this still, this time, stepping the right foot back, tipping the right palm down. Inhale, twist open to your left, gazing up your left hand. Little twist. Two more breaths. Keeping the right leg nice and straight. Keep sinking forward into that left knee for one more breath. And then slowly lower down your left hand inside the left foot, 
lower down your right heel and twist open to the other side for just three breaths. Again, gazing up, gluing your shoulder and your knee together for a final inhale. And then lowering that right hand down, stepping your right foot forward, toes together, heels apart, inhaling chair pose. And again, exhaling, folding forward, inhaling halfway, stepping the left foot back, left hand flat down and twisting open to your right. If you look down now, your knee should be on top of the heel, not behind it. Could even be a little bit forward, more forward than it. Two more breaths, Ujjayi breath, gazing up. Make sure the left leg stays straight for a final inhale. Now lower down your right hand, lower down your left heel to the inside and twist open to your left. Pressing the knee and the shoulder together, reaching your fingertips high to the sky. Two more breaths. One more. Lowering your left hand down. Stepping your left foot forward. Final strong pose. Inhaling. Chair pose. Three breaths. Gazing up. Almost there. If you don't have so much flexibility in your shoulders, just release the hands. Final inhale. And coming all the way to standing and circling the arms down. And relax. Giving the body a little shake. Coming light on the heels. Making the arms completely loose. Deep inhales and exhales. Feeling the lymphatic system, the veins, the joints, the muscles, the brain, the eyes, the skin, everything shake. Releasing any stagnation. 30 more seconds. Was there. And slowly coming to a standstill. Let's find our way one more time in a forward fold. Standing forward fold, inhale, raising the arms to the sky. Exhale, becoming long in the waist, reaching forward and coming down. Grabbing either your big toes, opposite elbows, the backs of your calves. Staying here for a few breaths, allowing your crown to be completely heavy. Three more breaths, Ujjayi breath. Hands release, slowly lowering down, coming to a squat. If you have a hard time squatting, you can lift up the heels, keeping the feet a little bit closer. If you are good at squatting, you can bring your feet a little bit wider, bringing your arms inside your legs, feeling your groin open when you pull them apart. Maybe you have enough space to bring your hands in Namaste Mudra. And then raise the chest, keeping the spine nice and long in one line. Opening the groin area, the inner thighs. One more inhale. Mm. 
walking your hands to the back, making sure that your heels are reaching to the front of the mat, coming to sit straight up, opening your palms to the sky forward. Again, raise the spine, raise the chest, and then we will slowly lower down over the count of 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and lower all the way down. Take a deep inhale into the nose. And a sigh out making sound. <sighs> One more like that. <sighs> And a final deep inhale. And release. Bringing your arms out like T arms. Bringing your knees up, shins parallel to the floor. Twist over to your left. Look over your right hand. Spinal twist. You could bring your left hand on top of the knees, giving some extra weight. And moving to the opposite side, twisting your knees through the air and lowering down to the right. Right hand can rest on top of the knees, gazing to the left, do that. Slowly moving back to center. Hugging both knees into the chest, neutralizing the spine. And straightening out your legs. Opening your palms to the sky, allowing your hands to fall open. Your feet to fall open. If you're in a cold place, maybe you want to put on some socks, take a blanket, put on a sweater. Use any props for the Shavasana. Stay here for a few minutes. Completely relaxing the face, the area behind the eyes, draining away tension in the skull, cheeks above the ears, heart open to the sky, belly soft, we will take one round of stronger breathing to open up the mind for a final release of any stagnant energy. Take a two-part breath, inhaling through the nose, first half, second half of the inhales through the mouth, and then you exhale completely through the mouth. And we will do 10 like that, through the nose, through the mouth, release, through the nose, through the mouth, release, like this, keep going, seven more. Six. Through the nose, to the mouth, exhale. Through the nose, through the mouth, exhale. Last four, through the nose, through the mouth, exhale. Through the nose, through the mouth, exhale. Final two, almost there. Exhale. Now your final breath, inhale through the nose, through the mouth and hold. 
only for three seconds, not long. And then completely exhale. And hold the exhale. Close the eyes, relax your body. Gaze far into the void behind your eyelids. Listen with your whole body. 10 more seconds. Look for a space between two thoughts. Three, two, one, completely inhale, about 90% full. Holding the inhale for about 10 seconds. Completely relax, surrender back into the earth. Before you release with a big sigh. And maybe you have another spontaneous breath hold. Slowly returning to a very gentle soft rhythmic breath. invitation to you is to after this practice to do at least a little extra meditation five minutes ten minutes maybe even longer I will link in the description a meditation video you could do for now thank you for practicing with me and I hope to see you again Namaste. Om. Um.